Hey guys, what is up? Testrat Gaming here with a demo video for the Lawn Mowing Simulator or Lawn Gear Simulator, I think is what it's called. Uh, link to their Discord will be in the description. Um, I got to admit, I played this game for a little bit. The demo is available till I think June 22nd. Uh, my first impressions on this game was friggin' th phenomenal. So I thought I'd get in, do a quick tutorial. I should go through the uh, the whole game with you and uh, basically go through the whole tutorial in the first two uh, long care. We'll probably, while we're mowing, we'll probably time lapse and I'll do a pros and cons of the game. I don't know. Figure it out as we go. Um, got to, I do have to admit though, for a game built on the Unity engine, it is a very, very well built game. Uh, it does have full controller support. Uh, I haven't tried it out with my steering wheel yet. See if it has steering wheel support yet. I will do that and I will leave a, a uh, comment in the, or I'll, I'll leave a, a note of it in the description of the video. Uh, so yeah, let's get in, let's go make our company and, uh, company logo and our character. So let's get started with the career mode. In this mode, you can create your own lawn mowing company and build it up or build up its reputation. As you expand your company and hire employees, you'll purchase more, purchase more mowers and new contracts. But first, your company needs to be set up with a name, a logo, and a uniform. So, let's get into making this, shall we? So, our company name will be T R G Lawn Care. We're going to purchase this grass logo here. Uh, I would uh, just a little note for like note for the developers. I I would love to see more variations in colors in the logo, so we could change the logo color and whatnot. Um, I think I'm gonna leave him. We'll just we'll, we'll name him. Test rat. And character that most suits me is this guy here. Well, not really. It's a woman. This guy here. We can change the color of the stripe of the hat. We'll go with like a, a John Deere green. Confirm it. Logo placement. Front and back. Uniform coloration. We'll go John Deere green. Which that's the John Deere green color I wanted. Confirm it and then we'll go with the John Deere -ish yellow. We'll go back to the hat. We'll get that green. And then we'll confirm and confirm everything else and we're set to go. Let's go try out a mower here. So in my playtest I did, before I did any recording on this, I did mess around with this mower here. It's a very nice mower. I like it. It actually sounds really good. I, I can't wait to get in so you guys can hear the actual mower sounds because this is really, really, really good. I got to give props to the creators on the sounds you did a really good job on this uh let's uh let's take this one for a test drive real quick i am going to grab my controller for this because it is easier with a controller to drive than with a keyboard
So welcome to the test driving area in career mode. Here you can familiarize yourself with the vehicles, yada yada, you left and right to look around, or left and right to move around, look around is R, uh, the R control stick. So yeah, we can move around, look around, walk around, just pretty cool. I gotta admit, I love the sound effects in the background. But, uh, no visual, right now, no visual traffic. Uh, and whatnot. So let's uh, go ahead and get on the mower. So to start up the mower, you're going to hold down X to start it. We can pan around the mower. Uh, I do have... There, there is one comment I really do want to make about the views, and I don't get that into that in just a minute. But let's hold down X on the controller here, and we'll get this started. Mm, listen to that. So on the arrow pad on your controller allows you to throttle up and throttle down. So this one actually for me sounds really weird. It doesn't really sound like it's throttling up. Um, Let's go ahead and get this off the trailer. And get it over here to the starting area. Or to the grass to mow. We're just gonna... We're just gonna mow willy-nilly. I don't really care because we're just, just test driving this. And this is not a property we have a contract on. Um, the animations for the, are really nice. The steering animations and all that. Uh, so... The one comment I wanted to make was this. I have to move my actually have to aim my camera down enough to be able to see the front of the mower. And I'll show you what I mean. This is like the best view I would say to put aim the camera at, first of all. So you can actually see what you're doing. When I go to reset the camera, I can't see that I don't see the mower down in front of me. I would rather be able to see the mower in front of me than being able to look straight out. That's just my opinion. But let's go ahead here. We're going to hit X to start the blades and we're going to just, we're going to cut at a specific height. You can raise and lower the, uh, the, uh, the blades. So we're going to cut at a four. All right, let's go ahead and X. We'll turn the mower on. Is there something different with this mower that I have to do? Something different I have to, we have to do with this mower. Oh, okay. So the front end, with this one, to drop the front end on this mower, you have to hit B on your controller. Then we can engage the mower. So. The mowing of the grass sounds really good. Because it actually sounds like a real lawnmower. So, when you're doing an actual job, you'll have the progression bar at the top. Oh, we stalled it out. I hit the wrong button. It doesn't really specify a cut height, so I don't know why I'm being warned for it. Uh, so there are penalties, per se, for instance, for hitting someone's, you know, leaf, um, not leaves, but uh, hitting someone's, uh, yeah, hitting someone's flower beds and mowing their flowers. 
but uh, the, that, that's pretty much that's pretty much all it is. You're just driving around, mowing, making sure you do a good job, fill the progression bar up, and whatnot. So I'm not really gonna fill the progression bar up. I just hop back on the trailer, which will end the the uh, tutorial. Well, it should. But we can uh, we can go back to the main menu here, and real quick, I'll jump cut back to where we're at the. Uh, uh, yeah. All right, so we are back at the mower selection system or selection area. So we're gonna go with the standard ride-on mower. I I just don't like the way that other one drives to me it's just a little clunky um this one i know works well for me because i have something similar to that in real life so we're going to go to our first job so to put an so what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to select an employee and a vehicle and send them on that job one i i don't know how really add any other thing about it because this is still in an early demo and you only get two lawns to cut but when you start building employees i think they automatically go to the uh they'll go and cut it for you and you just you'll break in money from doing that so we're gonna go to this property and we're gonna go and check out what we gotta do for this customer so I will see you guys there when we get there. Alright, welcome to the front garden of an old nook cottage. We have to get a cut requirement of 99%, which is pretty much we have to get every piece of grass. Uh, we have to cut at a specific height. Uh, we need to check the grounds for items. So we're gonna, before we start mowing, we're gonna go, we're gonna run around and uh, check to see if there's anything we need to pick up off the ground. Once we do that, we'll run back to our mower, start her up, and we'll get mowing. And I'll probably put the mowing in a time lapse, because it's probably boring to really watch me sit and mow, unless you want me to sit and talk. But I'm really just gonna sit, I'm gonna mow, put a time lapse up, and then we'll finish it up. And I'll probably. We'll go over the pros and cons of this uh, of the game. Maybe I don't know. All right, so here we go. We're gonna. You can hit RB to sprint. So we gotta make sure we pick up this toy rocket. Move that out of the way. Oh, there's an item here. I got some pebbles. We don't want the, those going through a customer's window. Uh, so the dog toy doesn't get destroyed and we're just gonna run around here and see if oh right here let's uh, make sure we get this really nice polished twig out of the way so let's head back so what you need to make sure not to do is these flower beds you need to not run them over if you run them over you end up well I guess you could say you'll end up getting fined by the customer. They won't pay you as much. So the camera sit angle for this is the same with this mower. I'd actually like to be able to look down towards my mower. This is a perfect camera angle than this. this up and let's get down to a five height on the blade we will get close to the lawn and we're going to engage the blades and let's kick on the time lapse
completed that lawn. So we're just going to cut through here across the property. And we are going to go empty the catch, ba catch bin on the back. Or catch bag on the back here. Uh, one thing I would like to see in the game is the fact that is the ability to, instead of having the catch bag, just toss the clip things anywhere. I know that probably would cause visual uh, gaming lag. Just make it so it throws the clippings instead of, instead of, uh, you know, to, uh, yeah, just mulch the clippings and instead of having them on the, leaving them on the ground, they just, basically, they'll just disappear. So we'll drive up, oh, shit, we'll drive up on the trailer and call it good. So, this basically is... Lawn mowing simulator. If you enjoy, or you have like, I don't know, if, I don't know if this is calling out people out, but if you have like, if cutting lawns is like your thing and your like, it's like your hobby, this I think would be the game for you guys. Definitely the game for you guys. Uh, if you're into doing lawn care, this is definitely the game for you. Um, down the line, when you get your company bigger, you can buy bigger and better mowers. Uh, once the game actually gets released and has been out for a while, I hope to see that they add a DLC with, like, American mowers and whatnot in it. Like, John Deere, Hub Cadet, and all them. Uh, but, yeah, so it'll also give you a contract result. So... I have no idea what I was fined for. I hit. I think it was for not picking up the ground object. Nope. Colliding with the customer's items. Not like their little terrace, that, terrace trussles or whatever the hell they're called. I collided with those a couple times. Uh, but you, you earn a little extra money by picking stuff the stuff up off the ground. If you don't pick that stuff off the ground, you get fined for leaving the objects. So... I would recommend picking them up. But, uh, yeah, so we go into the next. We go to that. Welcome back to the garage. So, the garage is where we can go. Like, so we're a little down on petrol. The blades are getting a little dull. Just starting to dull. The engine needs a little repair. So, what you can do is come into the main into the garage and do maintenance on your mowers. You can repair it to a percentage that you want, or you can full repair it. Same with the engine. Bring it, leave it or bring it up. I'm going to leave it. Same with the blades. Leave them. And you can fill it from right here. So you can also empty the collector if you decide not to empty the grass clippings at the end of the the, uh, the end of the job. But all in all, this is pretty much one, one mowing simulator in a nutshell. So, uh, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I've been Test Drive Gaming. Uh, if you guys would like a shout out in my next video, hit that subscribe button. Uh, also, make sure to hit the notification bell to get notified when I post. Uh, uh, yeah. If you want your name shouted at in the end, hit the hit the subscribe button, leave a comment. Also hit that like button, letting me know that you guys like the content. And uh, remember, my Discord is down in the link, in the uh, down in my links, along with my modding and uh, Facebook communities. Uh, the Discord for the Lawn Mowing Simulator group will be in the uh, description below, so go check them out. Tell them uh, Test Track Gaming sent you. Uh, 
Also, I am going to be starting, to, I'm back to streaming on Twitch. Uh, so if you, my Twitch will also be in the uh, description below as well. Go over there, hit the follow button and help me get to my goal of 50 followers so we can get affiliate, enter the affiliate program. So, but anywho, I'm dragging on this outro. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.